Well, good morning. We're actually on our way to uh, another, what do you call it, tour. It's called Taste the Rainbow Tour. Sure, and what yeah. we're going to be tasking is kind of do a little bit of pub crawling and food tasting. Food tasting. So this is run by the food experts you know in Palm Springs. In Key West. West. Yes. yes. So Sorry. we have to be there before 11 and mm -hmm. we're going to be getting like four drinks and then two two uh, meals free. So looking forward to seeing what they have. Maybe they'll have Tom Fritters. So we'll see. We yes. will see what they have. So right now we're on Duval Street and it's really pretty here. Yes, and the weather's pretty nice. Yeah. It's supposed to be raining a little bit later, but so far it looks like it's a very clear sky. Yes. The rum bar. I think we are here. This is eleven seventeen. That's it. So we're here. Hi. Yes. Okay, perfect. I have two tickets for you. I have two deer. Awesome. There's okay, two. So just in right now. Fantastic. Do you have any food allergies? None at all. having so much fun. I want to dress like this for all my children. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, the, the um, uniform is not nearly as fun, but okay, I'll take a good day where I can get some flair on. <laughs> so welcome to Taste the Rainbow. We're going to have a whole lot of fun today. We've got a lot of cool stuff planned out for all of us. And it's just the six of you and me today. I'm Rachel, by the way, your tour guide. Lived in Key West since December of 2016, eight years ago. Followed a boy down. He's my husband now. He's a musician and Key West has been full time uh, for as long as we've lived here. And I get to walk around town with people in bars and restaurants and share how much I love Key West and what I love about it with them. And they quickly become friends just in a couple hours, two hours. Yes. Yes. We really enjoy our life here. Yes. It's a simple yes. place to live, yes. a sunny place for shady people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're really going to enjoy it today. Mm -hmm. There's so much more to Key West. I think I just thought it was like a little bit of a boozy town with sunshine when I moved here, and it is that, that's for sure. But there's also so much more to offer. The history, the community, the culture, the beauty, the water, there's just so much more to it than what it originally thing. Yes, there are over three of the largest restaurants in this little tiny two by four mile island. <laughs> Uh, there's probably a hundred people who aren't starting to get the war, spending any money at. But the good thing about this yeah. tour is that you're going to get to see a lot of ones that are excellent. Uh, that shoot for the stars. He is, I think they'll be really impressed. Yay. And then as far as Key West food tours go, there's really, I've never had a more fun I love uh, so There's nothing You're better than getting to share world. your love for a big beverage with you. Uh, so or like my day. Day. But that's, I firmly believe that drinks and food taste better when you know you go to go the the person behind them. And the reasons that they are on the menu and their purpose and where they come from. So uh, I love getting to share that. I love food, I love drinking, and so this is a great <laughs> job for me, and I think you guys are probably going to see this Awesome. All right, a little bit of a breakdown. We're going to start here with a rum runner cocktail. We'll talk to you a little bit about the house before we go in. Then we're going to head across to the Rainbow Crosswalk. I'd love to see some pictures and videos of you guys kind of abbey roading it. Watch those. So gorgeous. And then we'll head over to uh, Mango's. We're going to have chicken and waffles there today. No local pop up. There's a little bit of regular chicken and waffles. <laughs> Sorry, I'll try to keep my bad jokes to a <laughs> And then when we leave there, we're headed over to Juju and Cupcake. Bar, one of my favorite cocktails in town. It's summery, it heats you up, it pulls you down during the And then we'll end all together at Mary Ellen's with some rainbow grilled cheese and a cocktail of your choice. Sound good? Sounds good. Awesome. Yeah. So we're here at the Rum Bar, Speakeasy and Rum Bar is its name now. This was the home of Raul Vasquez, a little bit of a shady character back in the day. He was uh, really prominently involved in the cigar industry. 
And when it was leaving Key West, you had to find a new job. Otherwise, no bankrupt. You have this big, beautiful home uh, built out of Dade County time, which you'll be able to see and touch once you get inside. So that's going to be the hardest wood you feel all. On your left hand. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Donald. Oh, yes, it's very it's really not. <laughs> <laughs> it's very, very dense, I promise. Um, and when we uh, get to go inside, you'll see how beautiful this home is. And he found a way to use his home to make money. And that was by becoming a rum runner, getting into that industry. And yes, it was illegal, but he was not afraid to get his hands dirty. He turned the upstairs into a bar. And um, a bar and more, or etc. if you will. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Let's out here. Raul oh Bar from Shades sit with a spanister. Hi, I see what those are. <laughs> so you see the bottles. Yeah. And there's also a couple other shapes in there, diamonds and hearts. The bottles symbolize the rum, the drinks that are being made upstairs. Oh, that's right. The diamonds symbolize a little bit of gambling. He had a card playing uh, game going on upstairs. That is still illegal in QS. And the hearts symbolize a little bit of love being made. He had seven rooms upstairs available for hourly rental. So times have changed. Uh, they have changed all seven beds, I promise. And now you can stay here in one of those rooms. Little piece of history for you, right on the wall, with a pretty cool amenity of the bar downstairs. Nice. You guys ready for a cocktail? Yes. Nice. They start at 200, which is great for the wall. Yes. Yeah. That's not bad. Wow. Let's put the money. Let's <laughs> have a cocktail. Money. Talk about one. Oh, you got it. We just started. Oh, wow. So we just get one. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. I will. <laughs> <laughs> for blackberry brandy, pineapple, OJ, and ah. grenadine for good measure. Sounds great. Well, yeah. cheers. Cheers, everybody. Cheers, everybody. Get a photo of you all. Cheers, squares. Cheers, squares. Cheers, squares. Yes, and I love it. Whoa. <laughs> that is so good. Pretty and strong. It's this pine here. Dade County Pine is the strongest that we have available to us. And these homes have gotten through hurricanes. And, and so it's like fires. has an anti-termite too thing, right? It does, yeah. It's weatherproof, uh, water resistant, and termite proof. Yeah. It's pretty amazing. I and love you this. You have spot. to have that. What are you going to drink? Drink is very nice, very tropical, very rummy. Has a slight taste of a banana, like she said, banana liqueur. Really, um, he was in a, in, a, in a cup, in a glass. Yeah. We love this bar, too. That's really nice. <laughs> on the streets here. That's one big plus. Do you have anything left? Rule of thumb amongst locals is no glass and don't be an ass. <laughs> and don't wind up on the Key West gravity page. Yeah, I can on the what? On the what? Chronicles. Chronicles. So we, we, have have we have to go to Atlas. Oh, I love Atlas. So Atlas is an Asian restaurant. He was saying it's much better than su sushi. So really? Really? So we're going there. What am I going to so nice. Really? Oh my god. Thank you went to Sushi Song or Atlas? Atlas. Atlas is amazing. Atlas stuff is better. Really? Oh my god. Are they open like 4 a.m.? Yeah. 4 a.m.? Probably not. Sushi Song is. Exactly. That's why I can after party. Sushi Song, in my opinion, has the best ramen in the world. That's right, guys. Where are you guys from? Sushi Song. Yeah. So Harley and Luis live here now. She's from Tennessee. Luis, where are you from? Um, they do it in February. Where are you from, Louisville? Originally. Um, I live here. I, but originally, where are you from? Oh, um, I was born in New Jersey. Gotcha. And you're I'm from, New Jersey. from Tennessee, but they both live here now. And then are y'all from Palm Beach, West Palm? I am a born and raised Floridian, but oh I was born goodness. in Miami. 
they did they passed out condoms and it was also just a week where everybody could let their freak like fly in a safe way <laughs> and so it's now morphed into a 10 day long celebration and if you've never been for a fantasy fest you gotta come back for one each, each day when do they have fantasy fest, fest? it's October. 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 October it's October it's October yeah, it always right? it always ends we have nothing for October so <laughs> it always always, always <laughs> ends on Halloween usually yes, usually yeah, yeah, okay, okay. The break, right the holiday <laughs> There's even, there's even, there's even, there's even like second floor, like, yes. like places oh, like yeah. this yeah. where yeah. they will literally sell out tickets just so you can be up there so you can people watch. 100%. I love people watching, yes. you know? There's nothing like it. <laughs> Hello, happy birthday, Janine. Thank you. <laughs> How do you do it during a tropical storm? I mean, how do you do that? Because they said it was going to rain today. But I'm just... This is your moment, your catwalk. Ah! Oh, she Gotta wants to take a photo of us like that. She I have to. <laughs> yes. So what do we do for the catwalk? Well, give me your best strut across. Okay. okay we'll let her know she can go. Bag first. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll take your best. We're gonna go this way, and I'll I'll be on the other side. I'll take your best strut, and then I do need one of everybody Abby roading it. Okay? Deal? Ooh. All right. Hey, thank you. Oh my God, I have that. Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. You got it right. Okay. <laughs> Very good, I like Louise. <laughs> Rumba, 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 Rumba. <laughs> stand up or lay down? Lay down. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay. Yes. <laughs> Paradise. Perfect. Yeah. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I love it. <clears throat> this is where we're going tonight. Tonight. So there's a kind of like a key lime, you know, cocktail we're having with the chicken and waffles. Ah, I said those, right? At mangoes. And you know what? This would be my little point. I need to be a birthday cake right there. Listen, that, that pizza smells really good. I know. Oh, yes. Is it good? Yeah, and you're a veteran, aren't you? Yeah. For pizza for you. Shut oh. up. Oh, fantastic. Nice and proud. <laughs> <laughs> I got one of the things. Marconi? Yeah. Thank you. Smiles so good. Beautiful. Tell us in the back are whipping up some chicken and waffles. Come on, they're brunch menu items. You can't just have that here anytime. It's just for drag brunch. I love chicken and waffles. Oh, really? Who invented that? It's such a good idea. Flavor the butter. So you know, it's a fried food, the crunch and yum. <laughs> Tomorrow? Sunday. 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 But it's a really Is it really like that? Oh. It has a Everybody, cheers. We're here. Cheers, Queen. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Donna. Yeah. Thank you. This constitutes, you know, bumping. It's delicious. What kind of alcohol is in here? Key lime vodka. 
Key Lime Bar. Key Lime Bar. From Texas. Oh, from Texas. Yeah, okay. Key Lime. Wow. Mm. Won't be too far from where you're going. Because it's still in Austin. Okay. At the Tito's Factory. Oh, okay. More than it's amazing. But they I don't do like, like any seafood. Oh, the idea of like hot dogs is just chicken fillet. Oh yes, a whole oh, chicken. Oh my god. god. Oh yes, this will do. Uh, do we have a knife? Yeah. Oh, yes. There you go. I can get a side. Thank you so much. She's a big stuff. This looks amazing. Wow. Chicken and waffles. So good. One of the greatest inventions of the world. <laughs> okay. Look at this. So, so good. Sorry. So what? Oh, okay. I've not done it, but I've heard, and I really want to do a video. I think you put it on the broken. And we heard last night how low it was. Like mm -hmm. Southern wow. style, so a little bit of the and there. Really? Yes. Yeah. 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 Cucumber, really all jalapeno spicy pop. You can do their uh, old fashioned. It's very traditional old fashioned. Woodford is the base of the bourbon there. Love or you can do their newest taco bell, which is called the Baja Blast. It's their take on Taco Bell's Baja Blast. So that has what you do uh, uh, with Curacao, melon, or it's very interesting. You get your choice, so you just let me know when you get there. And they've already put the grilled cheese on the griddle. It's half of the block of the case. We're not Sorry, you didn't really get your walk out. I'm already full. Oh, we're going to split the grilled cheese. So I only ordered like two of them, but then you have to order. Okay. Let's, yeah. I'm so happy with that. Margarita. Margarita? Something like that. You yeah. got it? Okay. But oh, did you want to put that on? That's amazing. Okay. Oh, 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 oh yeah. You're right. And you can order and eat it here. This is grilled cheese, please. Yeah. No wonder it's Oh my god. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take a photo. So so uh, far? What do you think? So far, amazing. Amazing conversation with a lot of wonderful people. Food was amazing. That chicken and waffles and the drinks. I think they hit me harder than I thought because boy, am I kind of like sedated right now. So we have one more drink, and then we have grilled cheese sandwiches. I don't know where I'm going to put it. And right now we are at Mary Ellen. And this Mary Ellen's bar is right. They have trivia night here. They have a place where you can order food. 
I guess grilled cheese is their specialty. They say they're humongous. So we're going to take a look at the grilled cheese sandwich. You see the flash going? Yes. Ready? Everybody got a corner? You can help me, Marconi? One, two, three. Oh my god. I love it. It is pretty. Is that, is that cheese? Rainbow cheese. Oh my god. Finally, my. How is a grilled cheese? It's pretty cool. Yeah. It looks like a fig. Maybe fig. I'm gonna try it. Let's see. I don't think I'm here. I'm surprised in your sweet. But I, I'm seeing what you're seeing. It's a good it's a good story, yeah. I see I do see sprinkles on mine. Yes. Mm. I'm so full of it. Oh God, I'm full. Like I love it. Yeah. I'm just full. Yeah. No, no. The order of a grilled cheese here is without texture. I was about to say, this tastes like, um, it's not syrup. It's like a brown sugar, isn't it? Kind of brown sugary. What is that? It's not going to come up. No, no. This, yes, this tastes the rainbow. Okay. Fine. So, oh, okay. What, in, what is in the top cheese? So it's three different types of cheese. It's uh, American pepper jack and smoked mozzarella. And you just use it's like edible sprinkles to make it rainbow. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh that's, that's a sweet potato. So tasty. Wow. So, but you're just for the sweet yeah, yeah. Yesterday and today. Oh, I got you. Back to where regular else, boring this tomorrow. I would, where, where else? Same places? It's a no, sweet It's all new. Yeah. We start at Rum Bar, then we go down and do the Eat Green Hill Cross Watch Shuttle video. Go over to Mangoes for chicken and waffles. We stuck over there for Fred to get me for Fred brunch. So you're gonna head over here for uh, grilled cheese and a cocktail. We're gonna go to over to the Love is Love meal for a photo. And we'll end it too, too. That's awesome. You mean we have another drink place? Uh -huh. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> I, 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 I can't. Like DJs on the weekends, we have a lot of dancing going on in that little hand floor. And then sex, the vibrator races. That we're talking about earlier. Right yes. Yeah. And so he, he's a great guy. We really like this. His business practice works so well because he always asks the locals, what do you want out of the bar? You know, this bar is so close to your house. What do you want in your neighborhood bar? And that's he essentially just caters to what their answers are. And so that's why he's so successful. He's got his name in six different bars and she left right now. Three full ownership of his. Get ready to go to Choo Choo because he's a co so. We like Chris. He's great at what he does. And it's spring day. It's so great to sit down and the wall. Oh my god. I love that. That's a, that's a work of art. partner was more than happy to get out of me. <laughs> oh, he was a hoarder, huh? Get him out of my business. They're starting to stink. <laughs> so, yes, they, they serve a much better purpose here. Right? And I, and I gotta say, you know, I know I'm a local, so I have some biases, but it's places like these that are off the main drag of Duval that I like coming to. Smoking Tunis is another one. It's in the back. Hanks is another good one. See? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, and Hanks has... We just have to come back here again. Hanks. Uh, Hanks does about dogs. Oh, it's really? a dog bar. It's a dog bar. Yeah. They even have drinks named after people's dogs. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah. All oh, dogs all the oh, time. Yeah. Get down here. Like, like, not only that, but like when, when DeSanta was doing the whole anti drag thing. They were the, the drag queens were out there at Aqua protesting it, basically saying, We're gonna wear the drag Janine, can I get your photo? Yeah.
I love this place. Right. Right. This is our last stop. After this would be the fourth drink, we had our chicken and waffles, we had our grilled cheese sandwich, we stuffed, and we we're really drunk. <laughs> We have what they call the Bubba Award. Last year they won voted number one for best gay bar. Oh my god. Uh, this one? Yeah. Oh, it's so cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's so nice and cool here. Oh. Hence the name Tutu. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, it goes by 22 and Co. or Tutus. So what makes Tutu? What doesn't make Tutu special? Tutu is life. Tutu is everything. Oh my goodness! Like this is a place where locals come to, like people who just kind of find out the free. Those that yeah, I would say like. Uh, for me, it's not like it's it's a little bit of 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 a little whether it's Pride or or Fantasy Fest, this is the place to get glittered up. <laughs> Hands down, this is a place. Oh, oh, they're so cute. Oh, they're so what an impressive drink! Beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. So excited! Thank you so much. I'm ashamed to say that I don't think I've been in two shoes for a while. It's just less shoes. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Cheers, cheers. This is our watermelon cooler. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's so good. That's so refreshing. Oh my god. That's so good. I love that. I love Wow, that's good. I got it from three pineapple sticks. Like, yeah. You just going to be like, oh, I found one on their website. They're like, what's the order? You made it like 25, 30 minutes. A little line here. It's excellent. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Take your drink. Uh, key lime martini. Yeah. What's it say? Mm -hmm. Luigi Ingram Westover. <laughs> the Westover. Is that the Westover from Massachusetts? <laughs> a little, lit, a little lychee. I love lychee. Pink pussy cat. I wonder how pink it is. <laughs> Take your pom pom, sugar pom pom, that's pom pom. <laughs> Banana hammer. Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Rachel, so we're gonna take other future food? tours with her. Yes. So mm -hmm. happy so pride, good to you guys. Thank and, you so much and, for coming along. You have a website? Please. Yes, Key West Food Tours. Hit us up. We'll be posting the content from our our Taste of Rainbow tour and all of our others. All right. So come give us a visit. Yes, we Key was amazing. Yes. So. Thank you so much for Booker. coming along. <laughs> yes, please do come with us. You're all welcome all the time. Yeah, thank you so much.